Hello and a happy new year to you all. I hope you all had a fantastic Christmas break and today you join me for another Forzathon guide. Now this is where I show you guys the quickest and easiest way to complete all of this week's Forzathon challenges. Now this week's one called Lemon and Lime wants you to own and drive the 1958 Austin Healey Sprite Mark 1 and it's actually a pretty easy Forzathon this week. Now this is the car in question, you can pick it up for 20,000 credits or I'm sure you can always find one in the auction house a little cheaper if you have a look. Now I have created a tune for you guys to use, you don't have to use it but it should help you out with the challenges. Now the share code for this is 166980393 and that's available for everyone to use. Now the first challenge here just wants you to earn 5 drafting skills in your Austin Healy. Now a drafting skill has to be done during a race and I'm sure you all know what it is. It's where you're literally following behind another car in front of you. Now I use the Moorhead Wind Farm Circuit race but you can use literally any race you want. It doesn't have a massive impact. I'd recommend going for one with a fair amount of straights on there instead of lots of sort of twisty bends because it's easier to follow behind the car in front. Now you don't have to be ultra close like right up their arse but you have to be close enough for obviously the drafting skill to count and there are four stages to the drafting skill as with almost every other skill in the game so as you can see there i got five literally within i don't know the first 20 seconds of the race there so it's super super easy to do uh, and it won't take too long at all now the next challenge here isn't so much a challenge as we all know, it just wants you to go on a 10 mile drive in your Austin Healey. So we're going to head over to the trusty motorway to complete this as we always do. Literally the reason behind this is it's the quickest way to rack up the most miles sort of, in a quick short period of time. Now this car as it's tuned it'll max out about 190 mile an hour uh, which may not seem uber fast when you compare it to everything else that you're driving which probably drives over 200 mile an hour but it will still get the challenge done fairly quickly. I'd say about five minutes and you'll have completed it. It is a bit tedious and a bit boring but it's not difficult which is always a good thing. Now the final challenge here, again, finish off on a high note is really easy, just wants you to get a total of 6 stars from speed zones. So like I said, this is super easy to do, and the speed zone that I always recommend using, as I'm sure you're aware, is the forest green. So 3 stars on here is only 90 mile an hour, so that means all you have to do is 2 runs of this, getting 3 stars both time, uh, and you'll have this challenge nailed. Now, in, in this Austin Healy, because it's been tuned, it's really not difficult to hit sort of stick it at about 120, 130 mile an hour all the way around. So it's not going to be a difficult challenge. It's not going to be a lengthy one. There's a couple of bends in here, but by the time you approach the last bend, you're still at sort of well over 130 mile an hour. So you won't have much to worry about. Um, but this week's Forzathon is super, super easy. Like I said, it won't be too difficult for you guys to complete and it won't be too time consuming either. So you can then crack on with the rest of the festival playlist. Now, if you've got any questions or queries about any of the challenges or anything else, just say so down below in the comments and I'll try my best to help you out as best as possible and don't forget coming up next is the photo challenge guide as well apart from that folks I want to say a massive thank you uh, don't forget if you are new to the channel and this did help you out to drop a like and of course subscribing that massively helps me out and stick stick around on the channel and stay tuned because I will be doing a massive giveaway where four people will be able to win a butt ton of money in Forza Horizon 4 Apart from that, folks, I want to say all the best. Make sure you stay safe and take care.